guys, my husband and I just took our five children to Great Wolf Lodge, Anaheim, California. And as a large family, it's really important to make sure that you prepare ahead of time and get the best deal. Great Wolf Lodge is amazing for large families and I cannot wait to share all my tips and tricks with you guys. <laughs> One of my favorite things is there's no sand, you don't need sunblock, and mama can just sit and relax if you have a little bit of older kids and watch them have fun. <laughs> the Anaheim, California location is located on Harbor Boulevard and it's quite close to Disneyland. So if you're coming from out of town and you have a little bit more time to spend, I think it would be a really cool idea to split your trip and maybe do a night or two at Great Wolf Lodge and then head to Disneyland for a day or two or even California Adventure. We visited just after New Year's and some of the Christmas decorations were still up. I heard that they have Santa and snow and other cool activities during the holiday season. Since it was our first time, I was really excited for my kids to experience everything, so we did purchase the paw passes this time, but in the future, since we've been there, done that, I probably won't purchase them again. I'll talk a little bit more about that later and what the paw passes come with, but since all of our kids are total water kids, we were there for the water park. As far as the rooms, they're pretty basic but functional. It has the rustic lodge vibe. We were not expecting luxury on this vacation. We just really wanted the kids to have a great time. And this adorable little bunkhouse room was a hit with our kids. It had three twin bunks and adorable paintings on the walls. It also had its own little TV, which mom and dad really liked because then we could watch our own movie while the kids are occupied in their own little fun hideaway cute little bunk room. Great Wolf has many different kinds of rooms. They have more of two bedroom suites, family suites, but my favorite part is that you can fit seven to eight people in these rooms, which is great for large families. At any other hotel in the world, you probably couldn't do that. You'd have to get two rooms, like two adjoining rooms for our family of seven, but we can have all of us in this one room for the same price, which is amazing. Each room comes with a coffee maker, a microwave, and a pretty decent sized mini fridge. We actually brought a rolling cooler in as well and was able to load up our fridge with some food for home, which is really helpful when you have a lot of hungry kids. So we're not constantly having to buy for all five of our kids. We can have snacks and quick lunches in our room. There's so many different activities you can do at Great Wolf Lodge, but for us, we are here for the water park. You guys having fun? What's your favorite slide? What's your favorite slide? What's your favorite? The red one. The red one? The blue one. What's your favorite? Saigon. Saigon? Oh, you're so cool. You're so cool. They do provide towels, but you have to give it back at the end, but you cannot take them out of the pool area. My biggest tip is to purchase some type of towel dress or robes that are absorbent for your kids because it can be quite cold walking back to your hotel or doing activities after you've been wet. Another thing is to bring Look how water cool this shoes. Place is. It's a massive yeah. play structure. This what so a man and I won on the race. You do you do you do you come down. Oh yeah so there's a bunch of slides over there. Great wolf we'll walk and also there's a wave runner, there's a wave pool. You could spend $75. There's daddy. Oh thanks dad. Forgot about the mask. One of the activities that my kids were looking forward to the most besides the water park was Magic Quest. So on the first day, we went ahead and went to the Magic Quest store and the kids got to pick out a wand. This activity is included on the Paw Pass. There's many different levels depending on the age and your child's interest. Um, they range in price a little bit. And we got the Paw Pass because I thought that was pretty age appropriate. It did not include like mini golf and some of the other activities, but in included the magic quest activity the free wand a cup of ice cream a cup of candy free credits at the arcade and a pair of goggles for the water park I do really like the idea of the passes because it's prepaid and the kids get to wear them around their neck and it's like a list of activities that they can accomplish throughout their whole trip and it kind of cuts back on hey can I have this can I do a build-a-bear well you can do whatever's on your pass oh, it's story time oh.
There's quite a few free activities in the lobby. Um, there's a schedule that they hand to you at check-in. There's arts and crafts and yoga and story time and there's a character appearances. Back at the water park, Hubby was having a great time too. He participated in this flow rider surfing type of thing and it was so fun. He had a blast and he actually was able to learn a couple tricks. Look at that, ooh, pretty slick, huh? It was really, really fun and it was really cool to see him get in the water and have fun with the kids and he went on all the large slides with them. I am good, I am just not brave enough for it but I felt better having the kids go with him. And seeing my husband do it gave my son enough courage to try it for himself. The cool thing about Great Lodge is they were always running some type of special. We were able to get 30% off our entire stay just from me like Googling and um, joining Facebook tips and tricks for Great Wolf Lodge for the Anaheim location. I was able to get a um, coupon code and get 30% off our entire trip, which really, really helped financially. And that is really important for large families. Another cool thing about Great Wolf Lodge is for every one night stay, you get two days at the water park. So even if you just book one night, you could come in the morning at 9 a.m. when the water park opens and stay till closing the next day. Even though you can't check in until one o'clock, you can still come earlier. And my advice is to pack a separate bag with your swimsuits, goggles, water shoes, anything you may need in the water park. You can't bring food in, but your swimsuits, I suggest you bring a second pair just in case there's nothing worse than putting on a wetsuit. But having a separate bag means you could just grab it and go to the water park, and then one of the adults can go check in at the hotel when it's ready. This way you can leave your luggage at the front desk or leave it in the car and just have fun. Okay, let's talk about food. We got these amazing nachos poolside. They were massive. It came in a huge pizza box. It had meat and sour cream and tomatoes and cheese, and we got jalapenos. I was really shocked by the size. This was $14.99. While the kids were playing, mama was chilling, and I got a ranch crispy chicken sandwich with Cajun fries. It was so good. For dinner one night, we ventured out of the lodge about 15 minutes away. There was a Mountain Mike's. We miss Mountain Mike's so much. We're originally from California and Nevada does not have them. We love the pineapple chicken luau, so that was a hit. But there are plenty of eating options on site. There's a pizzeria that has salad and pizza and calzones. There is a hungry diner, which is great for breakfast. There is a grill with a little bit more sophisticated things like steak salad. And then there's also a Dunkin' Donuts that we got donuts and they have breakfast sandwiches as well nothing better than donuts after yoga huh yeah. <laughs> this is so fun huh uh, well, so the kids got these wand. magic wands yeah. and we're playing this game called magic quest yeah. and they go around to different things we'll show you in a little bit but they I go around you. and they collect points there's like a treasure map <laughs> links the purest, most radiant light which you can summon forth to dispel any darkness. It may also be used to unlock magically sealed doors. To earn a dazzle, you must collect five crystals. Each glows with its own color. Blue, purple, red, yellow, and white. Deliver them to the charm of radiant There's one around the corner. Try the one around the corner. <laughs> Let me see those wands. Ooh, look at those cool wands. Show us how it works. Show us how it works. Watch out, guys. Hello. Okay, I'm doing this one. That's it. 
So is this a fun vacation? Yeah. Yeah? yeah? It's, really fun. it's fun, right? Mm -hmm. We'll have to come back. You guys behaved. Yeah. Hey guys. I would say the Great Wolf Lodge is like a Vegas for kids. It is so much fun. It's amazingly affordable for large families. You can always get good deals, has good food. And if you don't like the food there, you can always go out and venture out, or you can even door dash some food, bring your own cooler in. It's definitely affordable for large families. If you guys saw our last video, we are soon going to be welcoming child into our family. So we really wanted to just take this time to spend with our current five children and just kind of have like a little bit of a, kid moon or a baby moon so we will definitely be back to great wolf lodge let me know in the comments if you have any questions or if you have been to great wolf lodge and have any suggestions for me for our next trip bye guys see you in the next one she beat you she beat you oh, she had money